the ski industry should never be taken for granted. The resorts are fragile. I started skiing in 1969, and at that time, there were more than a thousand ski areas in America, and now there must be less than 400. A lot of these smaller resorts have disappeared over the last 20 years or so, and these big collectives have come around, and, and corporations. I think the large mountains are just pricing skiing right out of a lot of people's realm. I don't want to see our sport become elitist. It should be for anybody who wants to be on skis. Skiing's a very personal experience. You don't have to do what everybody else is doing. Yeah! It's kind of like dancing. You don't have to be good to enjoy dancing. You just kind of get with the rhythm. In this case, the rhythm of the mountain, the rhythm of the snow. At smaller resorts, everyone can get in. It's just hard not to feel the soul of skiing here. We're important because we want to stay local. We want to stay in the community. Enjoy. And I think it brings us back to where everything started in skiing. These are the things that drive us to understand that this is more than a mountain. It's a family.